Okay, let's talk about reasons not to move to Peters Township. Hey guys, this is DJ Fairley. If this is your first time to our channel, Living in Pittsburgh, make sure to click that like button, subscribe, click the little bell as well and make sure you're notified for all new videos. All right, so let's talk about some of the reasons not to move to Peters Township. Uh, uh, one of those reasons is prices have really gone up. So again, demand has really increased for this area. Being in Washington County, as I mentioned, taxes being lower that demand has really pushed prices up. So in Pittsburgh with an average price around that $225,000 mark, expect to pay really around a half a million dollars, 500,000 for most properties, which are gonna be again about a four bedroom, 3,500 square feet and above. But that higher price tag has pushed some people out of Peters Township and not wanting to live there. Another reason you may not want to move to Peters Township is commute time. So without traffic, it's not too bad of a drive, pretty much a straight shot because you're close to Route 79 and 19 to get to the city. But during rush hour and heavier traffic times, it could be about 40 minutes. So if you work downtown Pittsburgh, Peters Township probably is not the best place if you want a shorter commute time, say get on that, we'll call it five to 20 minute uh, one way commute time. Again, in Peters Township, you could be looking at 40 to 45 minutes each way uh, in heavier traffic times. All right, so another reason that you may not want to live in Peters Township is it's not very walkable. So as I mentioned in different videos, Mount Lebanon is one of the most walkable places, having shops, restaurants, everything, and kind of an uptown uh, street where you can kind of walk to everything. Peters Township really is a lot of beautiful communities, but to get to most things other than some of your parks within your communities, you're driving to almost everything. Now, on the positive, things are fairly close, but again, if walkability is something that you're after, Peters Township probably is not the best, best place for you. All right, and another reason why you may not wanna live in Peters Township is it has more, more of an affluent feel with a bit less diversity than other areas within the greater Pittsburgh or Western Pennsylvania area. So if diversity, culture, uh, you know, museums, things of that nature is something you're after, Peters Township really is, is not the best fit for that for you. Once again, if this is your first time to our channel, please make sure to hit that like button, subscribe below, and tap that little bell to be notified of all new videos moving forward about everything living in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania.